We're going to be doing some due diligence on this three-unit apartment building. Let's get into it. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Hey everyone, welcome to Holton Wise TV. You're watching the MLS Search and Analysis Show, and I'm your host, James Wise. And this three-unit apartment building you see behind me is what we are going to analyze for my clients, Rhett. Well, Rhett and his business partner, you guys, okay? You guys are out-of-state investors doing a 1031. You gave me a few days here to find you some properties. So I'm giving you guys a total of six properties that we can utilize your 1031 on. So this one... We got a duplex with a single-family home in the back, just cruising through all the photos. All three of these units are totally occupied. Nothing uh, major for you guys to, to see here. Just your solid little, uh, you know, decent little uh, rental property. As far as neighborhood quality goes, this is a B-class neighborhood. 33 East Walnut Avenue, Painesville, 44077. Been on the market for a little over a month, right? I know being in a B-class neighborhood was very important to you guys, right? So I thought this property would be of interest. They've listed it at $149,900. I would like you guys to pay $135,000. I think $135,000 is the correct price for this one. $149,000, in my opinion, is a little steep. Wouldn't be the worst deal in the world. But I think we could probably get that seller closer down to one thirty-five. dollars what will you get for that 135 Well, those three tenants, we are bringing in a total of $1,900 a month. That is $22,800 for the year. After you account for your normal performance uh, estimates, I imagine you guys should walk away with an NOI of approximately $9,744 a year. Now, will that be every single year? No, of course not. Every year is going to be different, but that's why I believe guys like you are so interested in going with that B-grade neighborhood, right? You guys said you want to do B-grade neighborhoods are better. Uh, you guys gave me a bunch of criteria. Some of it was hard to hit in such, the small, uh, in such a small timeline, right? It's Tuesday as I film this for you guys. Uh, you guys need to identify properties for that 1031 by Saturday. So doing a total of six videos for you. Some of them are going to fall into your criteria. Some are going to fall out slightly like this one, you know. Neighborhood, boom, we hit it. But it's a little smaller than some of the other buildings you're looking for. But, you know, inventory is tight. We can't, unfortunately, we can't sell you what doesn't exist, what's not out there, right? Especially when we got this time crunch. But. Hey, lenders. Our investors are looking to work with you. Send us an email at sales at holtonwise.com. Solid neighborhood. You're still getting a pretty high amount of rent. As far as the numbers shaking out, dude, at 135K, it's a 7-2 cap. And if we can do the traditional 30-year financing, that results in a 13.7% estimated cash on cash return. Nothing wrong with this deal. A pretty solid notch in the belt, in my opinion. But if this one isn't exactly what whets your beak, that's okay because I got another one that I'm going to show you right now. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.